Thanks for coming to the channel, Flay Media. Today, we're going to talk about auto former to color, polish, and finish your track using gentle preamp and compression and a gate all in one plugin. And this plugin was free. Let's get into it. Let's go. Okay, so the preamp section, this is going to be where your signal is coming in. This gain knob has nothing to do with that. Whatever's coming in, it's going to be your fader controlling the preamp section. You can turn that up, negative 40 to 40. This is going to be your gain for preamp only. And you're going to have your different circuits. Let's see. You have your British, American, and German style circuits. So it's going to give you different colors. Your mojo is considered your saturation, how much saturation you're looking to use. Going down to the balancer. Now, from what I'm looking at, this says it just balance out the level. So if you have a quiet part in your vocal and a louder part, you can level it out to an even amount. It's not giving you a real ideal grab on how you can see it. You would just have to use your ears on this. So this is a great tool to balance out your levels of your vocals or whatever your performance is. This right here is going to be your gate. We all know how a gate works. If you have anything in the background, you turn your gate on. It's going to knock it down. Any artifacts in the background and your seer is going to be how fast you want it to see how far ahead you want it to clamp down on your levels. So to make it a smooth, consistent flow. You want it at 25, 50, or 75. You can only hear that with your ears. You have a on and off switch on this. And the compressor is going to be just your regular gain. Squash. I would consider this as the threshold. How much you want it to squash down on your level. The fast or slow attack time. Low and high ratio. And you have a parallel mix, which is great. And you have your basic output on this. You have a bypass switch on everything. Preamp, you can bypass. The balancer, you can bypass. The compressor you can bypass. This is going to be your LED for your input that's coming in. This is going to be your preamp. You have your balance of gain reduction. So depending on how far you set your balance gain reduction, you have your compressor gain reduction here and you have your output meter. When you're playing your project, do not use the sear while you're playing your project. Always stop it, control it, see where you need to put it, then play. We're going to go to this vocal and we're going to use it on a piano chop and we're going to use this on an 808 and a kick. Let's get into it. Let's go. So we're going to be listening to the piano chop. Now I have the auto former is in bypass. It's recommended that you use the bypass down here. Let's listen to it bypass. Mm -hmm. Okay, so now I'm engage it. I have the level as far as preamp where I want it. And what I'm gonna do is just dial in the British. So you can see we're already getting some distortion on this. And for this demonstration, I'm going to just keep it at 100 and go through the circuits. I'm not using the compressor and I'm not using the balance. I'm just using the preamp just so you can see or hear how the preamp section sound. Now, is this preamp going to be a definitive tool for you to use saturation? 
Probably not. However, you can also pick up the Saturn, which is going to give you that great harmonic distortion. Let's hear with a sound with the fab filter. So the fab filter is going to give you that total harmonic distortion. Can I suggest you get this auto former? You should get it because this plugin was free. So there is no sponsorship going on with this, but I think it's a great tool. I think the most beneficial thing with this plugin is going to be the compressor and the balancer and the sear to level out your vocals without having to use a vocal rider or using the fader. Okay, so we're gonna take a listen to the vocal demonstration. This is just for demonstration purposes only. Let's listen to what we have. Shake this shit, yeah, a baby like a shake. She bang, she bang, she bang. Shake this shit, yeah, a baby like a shake. She bang, she bang, she bang. Shake this shit, yeah. Okay, so that's bypass, so with this, I'm just going to use the preamp, the compressor, not using the gate, and the balancer sear. Okay? So let's just engage it with the preamp. Yeah, a baby like a shake. She bang, she bang, she bang. Shake this shit, yeah, a baby like a shake. She bang, she bang, she bang. Shake this shit, yeah, a baby like a shake. She bang, she bang, she bang. Shake this shit, yeah, a baby like a shake. She bang, she bang, she bang. Shake now I think this plugin comes alive when the compressor and the balancer is activated. A baby like a shake. She bang, she bang, she bang. Shake this shit, yeah. A baby like a shake. She bang, she bang, she bang. Shake this shit, yeah. A baby like a shake. She bang, she bang, she bang. Shake this shit, yeah. A baby like a shake. She bang, she bang, she bang. Shake this shit, yeah. A baby like a shake. She bang, she bang, she bang. So it's almost pushing the vocals forward to the listening ear. And the sear is going to be at 9 o'clock. The leveler is going to be at 25. So I'm going to play with the leveler. Always stop the production when you turn in your sear. Bang, shake this shit, yeah, a baby like a shake. She bang, she bang, she bang. Shake this shit, yeah, a baby like a shake. She bang, she bang, she bang. Shake this shit, yeah, a baby like a shake. She bang, she bang, she bang. Shake this so you can tell that the vocal just seems like at a steady, no volume shift is going on. You don't need to ride the vocals with this. Shake, she bang, she bang, she bang. Shake this shit, yeah, a baby like a shake. She bang, she bang, she bang. Shake this shit, yeah, a baby like a shake. She bang, she bang, she bang. Shake this shit, yeah, a baby like a shake. She bang, she bang, she bang. Shake this shit, yeah, a baby like a shake. She bang, she bang, she bang. Shake. Let's bypass everything. Shake this shit, yeah, a baby like a shake. She bang, she bang, she bang. Shake this shit, yeah, a baby like a shake. She bang, she bang, she bang. Shake this shit, yeah, a baby like a shake. She bang, she bang, she And what I'm going to do is engage all the vocals now with the ad libs and background. I have auto former on there. So it's actually bringing the vocal up forward in your face. I think the auto former is a great plug-in if you can get it when it's 50% off or free. We're going to touch on the 808 knock on this. Notice that it is subtle, but it does give a little bump. Using the 
German on the 808 and the British on the kick. You know, it's subtle. Every little detail is subtle, but it brings out the performance as a whole. Don't forget to click that like and subscribe. You know how we do. We always going to see you on the next one, right? Peace.